Well, welcome back to our studio. We're, we're sitting back quite low on today's ones. We'll have a get, bounce. Get, going on these chairs is quite difficult. We'll have a bounce. Hello, Michael. How are you? Hello, Paul. I'm well. How are you? I'm great. All the better for seeing you. And we're just getting over our uh, bit of a flu here. I hope you're feeling all right. I'm immune to fuel. Good. To flu. Keep away from me. And fuel. Okay, look. We've got it's, it's Words of Wisdom, Volume 1, Pullyman Collins. Pullyman, of course, is how everyone knows you. And you've had these in the, in the, in the paper now for how long? 311 columns, oh. which oh. was uh, over six years. Wow. Six years. This, this all started, didn't it, just as sort of a... Uh, it might go for a week or two or something. Well, historically, up. I've got Parkinson's disease. Yeah. And you tend to set yourself challenges to prove that you're not as crippled and as disused and useless <laughs> as people sometimes might uh, think. But I'm being unkind to other people, I think. I'm, but I'm well received. A bit of therapy for you, wasn't it? When you Completely. This? To prove I could still do it. Yeah. Still cut the mustard, you know. So. You, they've been put out there. Tell me, who put, helped you out on this? Well, it started off as a hundred of, of my favourite columns. Yeah. It turned out that I just, I just picked a hundred at random because they're all good. Okay. There's 700 words ish every week for th six years now. I hear you've got a good editor though. Uh, she used to be. Name, name your editor. Um, I'll have to name her. She's Hazel T. She's a tiny self. Let's got that out of the way then. No, she. Because she, she kind of looks after, I believe. Hazel's good. Hazel is, um, uh, she's a good editor. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, th these all been in the newspaper, but uh, Every people haven't one. seen them or, or whatever. This now you get a chance, and I love it, volume one. You're very, you know, how well, many I've, go I've got enough another two volumes without any. Have you really? Well, yes, oh. 300. There's, there's 100 in each book. Oh, I see. There. But how, how do you find the things, tell me, you know, each week? Because that must be the thing when, when you do a column. I Everybody, know, I, uh, something new to think about each week. Everybody has that. Yeah. Sometimes I sit at the, at the time at the glass at the um, what do you call on the screen. Yeah. Fingers poised and having the faintest idea what I'm going to write. And Two hours later, I've got a column. And, and people really look out for that. I mean, I know it's kind of part of it. Which, which one of the papers is it in? It's in Independent. Independent. In um, the lifestyle section in the middle with all the artists and clever people and <laughs> I keep the tone down to my level. What sort of feedback do you get? Excellent feedback. It's what keeps me going. Mm. It's good for Parkinson's. It raises publicity for Parkinson's which is what it's all about. Every penny raised by these books or whatever I've done or whatever we've done is Parkinson's yeah. money. And it's brilliant. Can we talk about how, how are you? I mean, how progressive has it been for you? Because it, I'm it into my, uh, I was at the consultant the other day, and it was uh, 13 years, I think, now since I've had it, since I've been diagnosed. Mm. Uh, fine, you know, it's it's to use a word is rubbish. It's not nice. It's unpleasant, but you get used to anything you've got. I've got uh, blessings to compensate for the the, the bad bits. Mm -hmm. I'm still accepted, I think, but well, I know I am in, uh, as, a, as an ordinary person. The sympathy's coming in a little bit more now because I'm getting a bit slower and a bit... But you, how old are you? Nearly I'm 79, in, in a couple of days. Yeah. I'll be 80 next year. It's a very positive thing, though, I think, to let people know that... <laughs> positive, you let you get positivity get all the time. You've got to be thinking about what you're doing, mm -hmm. work for it and go for it. And this, as I say, keeps your, your mind tuned. I hope so, yeah. And you're always thinking of new ideas, and I mean, you know, oh, that'll make a good column. Well, we did a good, yes, always, yeah. I mean, an interview with Paul Morton. <laughs> it's a column. <laughs> 700 words about, oh. Gosh. This fella comes down I, in old tracky bottoms and... They can't see that. I'm, I'm not well, I told you. I'm, I'm <laughs> still slightly suffering. Um, where can people get hold of this? Uh, the, the, the list is endless, but the usual places are people who know the books and what, what I've been selling over the years. Um, Carson's Pharmacy in Onken and the Post Office in Onken Village. Um, Just Care Products up at the Strang, up at the Cool. Uh, bridge, I've been whispered in here. The bookshops, the Lexicon, yeah. the Bridge, North and South. Yeah. Um, I'm sure there's other people I can't remember, Sorry. but the Shop big right. one is Shoprite. Shoprite. 
ShopRite four main stores. Do you have a website or, or anything like that? I've got a website when my website man comes along to oh, put okay. it together for me. Okay, yeah. good. We don't do things unless it's needed, you see. And now it's ready to rock and roll. Uh, okay. So we'll have a website, pullyman.im, which is a... Uh, and, of course, it's just in time for Christmas. Pullyman.magstartnet uh, or whatever. Yeah. I don't know. Okay. Man, just Words of Wisdom, Volume 1, Pullyman Collins. Put, just put Pullyman in, you'll find me. As always, Michael, it's a delight to see you. And do you and see? As long you keep going on these things. I yeah, and can really you still? Can you still?